everyone, Amy Wood here. I'm at the Clydesdale Stables. Check them out. This is the Budweiser Clydesdales. Lots of little guys here to see these horses. You guys tell me. Oh, we're looking at the horses. Bottom. <laughs> tell me what. Tell me what you think of them. They're pretty big, aren't they? Yeah. What What's your first thought when you saw them? Uh, good. They were good. My favorite thing was the dog. The dog? Oh, there's a dog. It's a Dalmatian down there, right? Yeah. Is there one or just more than one? One. Yes, oh. One. All right, there's a Clydesdale. You see their famous feet? You always yeah. see them in the commercials, right? Have you yeah. ever seen the commercials for them? Uh, I don't know. I bet you have. And we think there's like a, like, um, two dogs in the cage, um, from the little one and the older one. So, um, we're just wondering about those, too. <laughs> gotcha. So what do you think of the horses? Um, they're unique. Yeah, what, look at them. They're really big. It's either feet. Do you think their feet are pretty unique with those fancy little white hooves? Yes. Have you ever seen a horse before? Yes. But not these horses. Not the Bud, Budweiser Clydesdales, right? No. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Well, thank you for sharing with me. So these guys are in town. They're going to be at Music on Main tonight in Spartanburg. They're also going to be at Spring Fling all weekend if you're in the uh, region. But if you've I'm curious to know, you guys, can you tell me, have you ever seen them yourselves? Have you ever run into these dolls in your travels? They've been here years ago, not before you were born. Yeah. Yeah, but now you're born, so you can be here to see them. Yeah. Pretty cool. Yeah. What do you think of the horsies? You like the horsies, Riley? Are they big? Yeah, did they make a funny noise? Did they make a horsey noise? No. You're the best nodder of heads I've ever seen. You're really good at that. Yeah? Fun times. Oh, well, this is Greg. And they have a lot of horses. I'm going to walk down. There's a lot of people from all over the area here checking out the horses. Again, these are the Budweiser Clydesdale. See? I'm not making it up. And uh, it's amazing. This is the stables. They're actually doing appearances at various events in the area over the weekend. And tonight, starting tonight and tomorrow, they're at a parade in Landrum, South Carolina last night. Hi. And uh, there are just so many different people here that are taking them in. And lots of people taking pictures. Look at this. is a great shot. She's getting a great shot. What do you think of these horses, ma'am? I'm live streaming on uh, the internet. They're awesome. They're beautiful. Yeah. Did you guys get to see them in the Landrum Parade last night? No. Hoping to get Susan to the Spartanburg one, though. Yeah, it's going to be great. Well, the, you got the good side because a lot of, of us are looking at their rear ends. I was so. over there, so now I've turned around. <laughs> this is a good one, yeah. He's beautiful. I think he was posing for me. Are Thank you a you. horse person? Not really. I love to photograph. Them. Oh, well, good job. Enjoy. Hey, you guys, what do you think of the horses? Tell me about it. Um, they're really big. Really big. Did you think they were going to be this big? No. Have you ever seen them in the commercials? I have. You have? What do you think? Is this as good as watching the commercial? I know I always feel emotional. The commercials are very emotional and kind of stir your heartstrings. Is it the same, better, different? What do you think? Uh, it's better because Be they're bigger. They are. They really are. And uh, they were in a parade here last night. Did you guys get to go to the parade? Yes. You did. So you've seen them marching in their full gear and everything. Yes. Awesome. You yes. too? You didn't get to? Well, that's really cool. What yeah. do you think? I, I think they're awesome. I took them to the parade. They really are a lot of fun to watch. They're so we wanted to get out and get a close look at them. So they're really great. It's a great experience. It is really cool. Well, this is a really good one. And lots of pictures being taken. Lots of little people, babies, and young men. And older men. <laughs> uh, uh, you're so funny. I'm kidding. Howdy, I, I just turned yeah. 50. I'm, I'm heading on up the hill. So hey, I'm here. Right, okay. yeah, I know. Us right, too. Right. Us too. Yeah. Well, y'all have fun. Yeah. Enjoy. Are you from Spartanburg? Or where are you? Okay, so local Pine folks. Street. Pine Street. Pine Children. Street. Awesome. Uh -huh. Do you know my daughter? Yes. Awesome. Oh, well, that's, that's nice to meet you. Gracie, yeah. she's in fifth grade. What grade are you in? Third. Third. Okay, well, that's awesome. Well, y'all have fun. Enjoy. Thank you. I'm going to try to get you guys to the handlers. The handlers are down here. They're actually gearing up because they're going down to Music on Main. So they're setting up to take them and hook them up. There's the horses. This is the massive stable to give you a sense. And this is next to Restoration Church, right off of Interstate 26, if you're trying to find it. It's at the Budweiser factory in Spartanburg on Pottery Road. And there is the truck. Look at that truck. Lots of trucks. They'll be loading the horses into uh, air-conditioned vans. And Mr. Handler, Handlers, 
Streaming live, Amy with WSPA TV. How are you guys? Good, how are you? So you guys are getting ready to go to Music on Main? Right, yep. And that's fun. Yeah, should be a good time tonight. How was the parade last night? Oh, it was really crowded. A lot of people came out to see us. It was great. Yeah, good good showing. And uh, what, what's going to happen now as far as um, the process of getting them from here down there? Uh, well, before we go, we still have to braid their manes and tails, and then we'll load them up on the trucks and uh, head down to the start of the parade, and we'll hitch them up to the wagon once we get there. And do you braid them in the stalls? Right, yep. So if people are coming down this afternoon, they can see you braiding them. What time will you be doing that, probably? Uh, about um, 3.45. Okay, so about 3.45, if you want to see them being braided over there in their stalls, and then you'll load about what time? Uh, four, we'll be uh, ready to go at 4.30. Okay, and then they're going downtown, and what time technically you're there, 6 to 8? Is that the right time? Uh, yeah, that's, yeah. That's so technically, if you want to see them in downtown Spartanburg, they'll be six to eight. Are you actually, are they going to be moving around? Or are they just going to be kind of still? Uh, no, uh, there should be, uh, there's like a little route where they drive. Okay, cool. And they'll just kind of circle around? Right. Very cool. So that you will get to see them kind of uh, walking, trotting? Walking. Walking. Okay, they'll be walking. No trotting. No, no trotting loud. No running. And these are crazy um, facilities that you have. This is actually the trailer that is for this really cool old timey. What would we call this? A wagon? This is a wagon. A wagon. And old timey beer. <laughs> so funny enough, we had our uh, meteorologist doing an interview last night and asked a little boy, you know, what did you think of the whole thing? And you know what he said? He said, wow, they had so much beer on that, on that <laughs> wagon. <laughs> it was funny. And I was like, wait, what happened to the horses here? We need to talk about the horses too. But I guess Budweiser's a smart uh, marketing company because they know the horses uh, bring lots of cool attention to the product too, right? Yeah. Very good idea. Look at this. This is like an old feed bucket, I guess, of sorts. But nothing that you actually use. It's just decor decorative. Right. Very cool. Where are you from? Uh, this team travels out of Merrimack, New Hampshire. Oh, cool. I used to, I grew up in Hillsborough, if you can believe that. Oh, wow. So, you know, yeah. I know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> I know where you're from. Um, well, that's very cool. I used to spend a lot of uh, time skiing at Pat's Peak. Okay. New Hampshire, so, yeah. very cool. And um, how many people, like, in terms of the crew, all of you guys, what, how many people are involved? Oh, uh, there's seven, seven of us. Okay, seven of you. And how many horses? Uh, they were, they traveled 10 horses and eight of them pulled the wagon. Okay, let's talk about the other places you're going. Okay, tonight is spring, is uh, Music on Main. Tomorrow, I understand one of the horses will be at the Walmart in Lawrence, is that correct? Oh, uh, that's correct. And then any any other things that we don't know about? Uh, also, spring fling. Back to fling. spring fling on Saturday and Sunday. Okay, and then people can come see them at the stables in the morning hours, right? Correct. And that's a good time to come? Yeah. Awesome. Well, thank you. What's your name? I'm Dave. Dave. That's Dave with the Budweiser crew. He became the spokesperson today. Sorry to put you on the spot live streaming here. But uh, again, if you want to find this, this is next to Restoration Church, which is right over here. They're actually parking people over there. And then you can just kind of walk over to the Budweiser <laughs> factory. That's the building. You're awesome, Dave. <laughs> His friends are giving him a hard time. Way to go, Dave. <laughs> All right. So we are uh, continuing to take you back over. Let's see some horses, right? Take one more look at the horses, and then I gotta go to work. Channel 7, we're taping teases at 3.30, and I gotta be there. Hi, you guys, what do you think? Did you like them? They were good. Yeah? Bigger, smaller than you thought? A lot bigger. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty amazing. Um, are you gonna go downtown to see them at Music on Main, or maybe over the weekend at Spring Fling? Maybe at Spring Fling. Okay, cool. Well, y'all have fun. Thank you. Bye. All right, so uh, we're headed over to see a few more horses. Hey, how are you? And uh, this is the, well, this one's kind of speckled. Look at this one. A little different coloring. How pretty. And there they are. They say they're the uh, weight of a Volkswagen Beetle. So think about that, 2,000 pounds, 18 hands. Very big horses. And there they are. So we'll end with the horses and uh, appreciate you guys. I'll see you on the news. We'll have uh, a lot more coming up. And on my Facebook page, if you go to facebook.com slash Amy Wood, you will see a post there with all the details about where you can find these horses. So check it out. And I'll see you on TV tonight starting at 5 on 7 on your side. Thanks for watching. Hey, Dylan.